there are six different types of literature review. Number one, systematic literature review. Systematic literature review is the most comprehensive type of literature review. In a systematic literature review, we very religiously follow the methodology of a systematic literature review. What it means is that we need to be very careful in terms of the collection and analysis of data. How we select papers, we need to follow a strict collection, inclusion, and exclusion criteria for the papers. Number two, scoping review. A scoping review is primarily done for a field where there doesn't exist many existing literature reviews. So in a scoping review, what we do is that we collect papers in that field. And then what we do is that we look for to identify the different kind of concepts, data sources, and evidence underpinning that particular field. Number three, integrative review. In an integrative review, what we do is that when we collect different kind of secondary studies or research papers, we look at them from a critical point of view. We identify the strengths and weaknesses of each paper. And then based on that, we identify gaps in that literature. Those gaps are then used by other researchers to fill in their own primary research. Number four, narrative review. In a narrative review, what we do is that when we collect a pool of papers, we try to look for different kinds of trends and patterns in the papers so that we can give a comprehensive analysis of that field. In a narrative review, we also give different kinds of areas for future research. In other words, we identify based on those patterns and trends in mappings, we identify gaps for future research. Number five, historical review. In a historical review, as the name itself suggests, we look at a field over time that how this field has evolved over time. So if we take the example of, for example, uh, computer vision uh, and let's suppose medical diagnosis. So we can look at the level of accuracy that how the level of accuracy has increased over the years in this particular field. Number six, uh, metasynthesis. In metasynthesis, what we do is that it's mostly applicable for qualitative papers. So we collect papers that are done qualitatively or that have been uh, reported qualitatively. What it means is that those papers, they have collected data from, let's suppose, interviews or questionnaires or observations, and then they have reported their findings. So in a metasynthesis, we focus on these kind of qualitative papers and we study them and then we put forward a more abstract view of that field of research. So just to summarize that when you're doing a literature review, it's important that you also reflect on what kind of review you need. So once you know the type of review, then it would enable you to do a far better literature review.